Here's a voice. Come on, babe, you know this. It's a 17 minute. Mind you, look, and this is supposed to be a voicemail, right? So if we look at the bottom, it's a 17 minute and 50 second voicemail. I don't even think you can run them that long, can you? Can you run a voicemail for 17 minutes and 50 seconds? A voicemail? I don't leave voicemails. So why I cut off right there? We, we about to get in. We think we about to get into something. I'm sitting here with my head down, like, all right, let's get into it. Let's figure it out. Why I cut out and cut back on? Nobody's ever pointed this out. Nobody's pointed this out ever one time. I would never do karma like. Take everything that I'm saying in consideration. I mean everything I'm saying to you tonight. You're right, I am faded. But I wouldn't want to wouldn't have wanted to share this shit with nobody. Yeah. I wouldn't even hop on live. Never mind, I said it was a voicemail. This is this seems like a phone call. It seems like a phone call. Check it out though. And like letter like like that shit. Bro. They say when you're drunk the truth comes out, right? Right. They say when you're drunk, you're telling the truth. Oh, so that's so. This is all how you feel about me. You, you feel like, right. oh, okay. So you, so you send flowers to a bitch who ain't shit. I get it. So, if this a phone call, why is her voice in the call with me? Why does it sound like this is somebody who's talking? to a recording. I try, listen to me, homie. I tried to have action out the on a cool note. No drag in a brown paper bag, no uh, trying to dismiss her. She played herself and want to get mad at me. You played yourself, baby. I walked away. If I would have been calling this bitch every day, she would have a recording for y'all every day. Let's be real. Hey, she hold herself because she hold herself out of a good nigga. That's real shit. And ladies, y'all need to learn that. She hold herself out of a good nigga. I never did nothing bad to that bitch. Nothing out of character, out of pocket. Bitch got some flowers. The bitch made me some money. What's the problem? Okay, cool. Sent them to her. Here. Appreciate you. It made me some cool dough. She's giving me a lot of content. Content makes money. And she's been nothing but a cool chick. What was wrong with sending a bitch some flowers? You act like I sent the bitch five bands and said, here, I just need you to have this. Go shopping on me, baby. Go have all this. Go have all that shit. Here you go. Matter of fact, I got another 10,000 coming to you tomorrow. Here, take this. Bitch got some flowers. I appreciate you. This shit's all a tax write-off for me. It's all through my business. Anything I do, hey, man, it's nothing but love. She made me some bread, my nigga. Hey, here you go. Well, I'm supposed to be a dickhead? I guess so. I guess I'm supposed to be the dickhead. Bitch, get some flowers, my nigga. That's supposed to be the highlight. Now, all of a sudden, that's just, oh, my God, Sharp, why would you do that? Y'all can't even believe that I got some game like that to do something. Like, like is, that, is that fucked up? Bitch makes me some bread. She got some flowers. Cool. How is that ever a problem? That shit's, in, that shit's insane to me, my nigga. That's why niggas that never do shit for bitches that do do something for, or they find a way to feel like, all right, this bitch did something for me. Here, here it go. It's got to be misinterpreted or misconstrued. I'll do it again tomorrow. Give me some motherfucking, hey, give me some dough right, nigga. Here go some flowers for you, too. What do you mean? It's a gesture.
She made me some cool bread, man. Number love to her. He needs to get through this shit. Bitch, that I'm yeah, do you, a bitch that. So you went out of your way to spend your birthday with me, but I'm, I'm, I, but I ain't shit. All right. I'll drink to me. I went out of my way to spend my birthday with you, bitch. I was coming to Florida. And what'd you do? What'd you do? And you know what's so cold? Because I don't even be talking about it. I don't be saying nothing to nobody about none of my experiences or any bitches I've ever been with. What'd you do? You came. You picked a nigga up. Black truck. You picked me up from the airport. You came and hopped right on a nigga lap. This is facts. She came and hopped right on a nigga lap. Happy that I'm there. Now all of a sudden, bitch got a problem with me. But you was happy that a nigga was there. I ain't paid for shit the whole time. I ain't do shit. I had a flight to catch after my birthday. Here we go, Tampa, five days. What are you talking about? You knew this. Man, please. That's on my kids, nigga, on my soul. I wish you'd just leave me alone. Never said nothing. Like, damn, bitch. Why she acting nuts? Because she liked that shit. She liked that shit. Don't no bitch act like that that don't like it. You don't feel that bamboozled bitch nobody came in your house and stole from you they ain't put no cars or houses and shit in your name where you just feel like you just ah the world needs to know how much of a monster he is nobody did nothing to that bitch what you mean even in real keep it real man <laughs> i'm just telling the truth Tell the truth, shame the devil, they say. I'm doing just so. You're right. I, I, I will admit that I was wrong. I'm wrong for thinking that a bitch was cooler than what she was. Straight up. That's I, I, I miss pimped in that aspect of life. I thought the bitch was cooler than what she was. I didn't think that a bitch ever needed to piggyback me in your in your downtime. I don't like to, I don't want to ever choose those. I thought the bitch was a top-notch bitch until she showed me that hey, the type of shit she's gonna do is not gonna be that. Happens, my nigga. We all live and we learn. Straight up. We all live and we learn. I thought the bitch was something that she wasn't. And that's no diss, no extra. Just I thought she was something. I didn't think she would move like that. That's my fault. That's 100% my fault. And I take accountability 1,000, 1 trillion, million percent. I thought I knew something that I didn't. Or wasn't that I didn't know, it was just I was moving too fast. And I think that was a up way of me trying to force puzzle pieces together and that ain't the way it go. And I ain't see it until it happened. So that's on me, I'll take that one. Yeah, I gave her trust. I didn't think the bitch was like that. Because you see, she never talked crazy. If, even if she was talking to me, wasn't talking to me, she never talked crazy to me at all. 
And I always kept it real with the bitch. I know that bitch missed me. Me and her was homies before anything. I knew she wasn't no hoe, nor did I ever play her as one. Straight up. And that's facts, like just to like settle the, the myth today, man. Like we don't talk about it, we don't say it, and I don't try to bring it up, but I see it had to be a part of this, and that's cool. You know, so maybe we should have rekindled this a little bit. But I really got no hatred towards Lil Mama, homie. She just hurt a little bit. People get hurt when, and we, we all victims of that, when we get hurt when we think it's something that is not. Or not even that. I just think she was mad that I have her back. At a time, she wanted me to have her back. Real shit. I, if I really sum it up, as a, I'm, I'm going to take myself as an outsider looking in. She wanted me to have her back at a time that I didn't have her back. She wanted me to say something. And I felt like I said enough when she asked me, like, Sharp, am I thirsty? I said, no, you're not thirsty. Those few words coming out of my mouth to her, if she me, should have stood for everything. But it didn't for some reason. She made me a cool bag. That's why I can't even be mad at her. Like, she made sure she came and gave me much content. Like, it's nothing but love to her, like, in that aspect. But to downplay me and talk crazy about me and try to, like, have the, you got these recordings. I got these recordings. Like, listen to them. Like, what's this prove for you? That this was somebody that was really trying to with you or somebody who's really trying to diss you and dog you? Because they say I'm a nigga that's known for dogging and dissing bitches, right? So what's really going on? I'm confused. Sound like I'm being cool with the bitch. If this is me, I'm being cool with the bitch, right? Damn. She don't got no freaky deaky ass stories with me. Like a real friend. I'm talking about where she just did me something. Like she don't got none of that shit, my nigga. That bitch was cool and I was cool, nigga. She know what it is. But she know a lot of dumb is gonna believe a lot of the bull. You dig? So she played on it. I ain't mad at it. Had a $30,000 play today. I will drink this. Oh. Uh, drink, wait, bro. Drink what? Keep this all day. You right. Sharp here. Oh. A bitch that I yeah, do a bitch that. So you went out of your way to spend what? your birthday with me, but I'm, I'm, I'm right, but I ain't right. shit. Right. I'll drink to me. Yeah. Had a thirty thousand dollar play today. Yeah, I said I'll drink to me. Okay. Sounds pretty damn good. <laughs>